In a bid to unite all Malaysians, a group of radio DJs have initiated a campaign that seeks to turn May 13, a black park in the country, into the start of something far more positive. The DJs of Red FM, 98.8 FM, Surya FM and Capital FM have banded together for the campaign dubbed Kamilah Malaysia, which they hope will be fitting counterpoint to the recent tensions among Malaysians following the recently concluded 13th general election. The Star Radio Group Deputy Chief Broadcasting Officer, Kutsia Kaha, explains that the campaign was just a thing the country needs in a time where emotions were still running high. Um, there's a lot of um, a lot of us who feel very strongly about this, that yes, you know, um, GE13, you know, uh, caused emotions to, to run high because people have their own belief systems, people have the right to vote for whoever they want to vote. But, you know, let's not forget humanity and we need to get back to that. So uh, a lot of the announcers, you know, felt that, hey, we should do something. And uh, so, you know, we're going to try and, and um, run it for as long as possible. But uh, we also, because there are a lot of other campaigns also to try and unite people again that are also running. So uh, as long as people don't get tired of it, you know, we'll continue the message. She said the DJs will also produce a music video entitled Mulanya di Sini, a popular hit in the 1980s by local band Freedom, where it will be sung at at least five different languages to signify the country's diversity. Kudzia says the campaign also involves public service announcements as well as giving away T-shirts to lucky listeners. Kamila, Malaysia!